Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Zane Lamota. Those who love me call me Mazet. Those who hate me call me Mazet. But either way, please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Okay, now. Someone asked me to tell the story about how I got lost on a train months ago, but I completely forgot to tell the story. So now I'll be eating and I wanted to specifically tell the story when I had like mad cravings and I knew good to I'd have mad cravings on the first day of my period. So a little bit TMI but start seeing so if you didn't know yesterday is the first day of my period. Yay! Finally! Okay, I'm kidding. No, not finally. But yeah. So I'll be having the soul bites from chicken licken and i'll be having this from fake cake city and i'll also be having two foot cakes right here they are in here and my little beverage which is coca-cola for today i really wish i could have sat by my table guys but i didn't like the lighting and i didn't like the background it just looked really dodgy so i just went back to what i know best and that is my little corner i didn't want to sit a sitting room or a study or anywhere else in the house i wanted to shoot it in the comfort of my own room because i know what if i shot this video or the story time in any parts in any other parts of the house no, I just wanted peace and quiet and I just wanted to eat my food in peace. Let me taste this first because I've never had them before. Okay. 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 It's a mukbang without you actually seeing the food button yet. Okay. This happened in 2015. And as you guys remember, what I told you about, I used to live in Jimston with my dad and I will say this I don't remember the what I named that girl so I'm not even gonna attempt to think or try and remember but the girl that I lived with the one that jumped off the train let's just give her another name Sne. Sne has jumped off the train and has decided that she's not gonna go to that school that was in Boxburg where we were upgrading mm. Now it's just me and my dad who live in Jimston. There was a train station close to the place where my dad and I lived in Jimston. And that na the name of that, should I say? So that train station that was close to my house was called, I think, Jimston Lake Station. And if you know Jimston Lake Station, that station is almost dead. So that particular day, I remember it was a Thursday. I wore these other pants. I don't have them anymore. I remember I just had this bad feeling. Like I just, I felt like these pants because not to uh, my friend, you know. And I just, it wasn't even about that, but it was the fact that I felt like they're giving me bad juice. So I was like, you know what? It's fine. I'll wear the pants. And I went to school later. I'm going to if you were upgrading. to will get them about half past two or two o'clock. And then she's like about five. The train I'm waiting for is going that way. Once I get it, I take a train from Jimston Lake Station. And then I take, and then I get off at Jimston Station, the main station, the big one. The one that's close to the rank in Jimston. And then I get off there. And then I wait for another one that's going to take me to the school, right? So that day specifically, I was waiting for the train. And the train that stopped had like chairs inside when it opened when the doors opened it was this back-to-back -back type of situation hi fast forward i saw this other guy sitting alone and the train was empty but i was like okay sharp anyway it is around one o'clock it's not like rush hour so what to expect to get on the train because it's going in the direction other friends that i heard from the school that I met them. My body from the code at the top. No, I didn't know that. I just knew that the train has to go that direction. It opens, this guy sitting alone. I get in. I, I'm like, hey, this train is like very different. But anyway, I get in. I sit down. Sharp Vele. It stops at Jimson Station. I take another train to the school. I Sharp Vele. And I meet up with my friends that have made Vele, that have met them. Specifically, I'll talk about this one friend, the one that I, I briefly mentioned, Guti, she was seven months pregnant, but I didn't even know she was pregnant. The pregnant friend, let's call it Lisa. Well, Lisa lives in Cutler Hall. I live in Jimston. That day, I live with Lisa from the train station that's close to my school to Jimston Station. 
and then from Jimston Station, we take the same train on that side together. She's going to Katlehong, I'm going to Jimston um, Lake Station, which is close to Jimston Lake. Sharp. So I'm like, I, I'm at ease because she looks like she knows these things, but I need to call her like Josie, so I'm safe when I'm with her. Keep in mind, I don't have my phone with me. That day, I'm getting training. It's no Lisa. It's a totally seat because usually you don't get a seat when it's rush hour. You stand. And keep in mind, guys, that same train that we used going back to our homes is the same train I took when I was going to school. So the seating arrangement was the same. So I was like, oh, okay. Fast forward. Get to Jimston Station. Sasala pants, guys. It's like Ulisa is pregnant. I get a seat. She sits on top of me. So now the train, I know which from Jimston Station to Jimston Lake Station. It's not that far. So once I start seeing the river, the lake, what the river, the lake, I need to start getting up. You can't get up when the train stops because it, it don't do that now. We Lisa at the time had a blackberry. I don't remember what kind of blackberry it was. I also had a blackberry, but mine was more modern. Like, or oh, not more modern. What's the word? It was more, at the time, it was the latest i'll uh, put in a picture of lisa's black blackberry and my blackberry as we're in the train i realized good man they didn't say i'm just cut the seats i'm going to be busy laughing when i know lisa guys because they're papa we're 19 at the time it's peak time sit there the other people are standing like it's it's an achievement because i realized with this train from Jimston station has been going for a long time and i'm not even recognizing the route keep in mind this is the next week this is the week after i think i named a bootle jumped off the train i asked there was this other guy who was sitting right next to me i asked him about him he told me the train at jimston deck station he does this <laughs> Because daddy can't be trained, and I'm only asking now, I'm guessing that's why you laughed or he smirked. He's like, hmm. Yeah, this is so good. Ah, so I'm chilled. I'm chilled as a cucumber. I'm cool as a cucumber. You poly, like, guys. I'm like, no, man. Like, now I'm starting to feel uneasy. Like as much as I'm not used to this train thing and i'm not used to this area i'm not used to job i know it's not supposed to take this long until i start seeing the lake i swear to you guys maybe two minutes later after i asked that guy maybe two minutes later maybe even two minutes was too long maybe a minute and 30 seconds he tapped me on the shoulder and said i said i was like and keep in mind guys this is like we knock off if you're upgrading it's from two to half past five so two to five or half past five and from that time you have to walk to the train station that's taking you to jimston station so you're not gonna get to jimston station car five so it's already late so you probably and it's a long walk to freedom from that school to that station that's close to the school it's probably like a good 45 minutes and then you have to wait for the train whenever it passes so it was probably it was i think when you got to when I was heading home, it was to 8 o'clock. Hi. When I said, maybe it was 7 o'clock, half past 7, quarter past 7. The way when Taga sang a corner, Guapella won't go long. I was about to pull a chair, sing to it, I was singing a chair again. Ulisa still laughing because Ulisa would laugh even if a train flew by. I mean, I'm so sick, but because I'm so sick, he's pulling a wagon, and I'm like, yeah, the train is going straight to Katla Hong now. So apparently, if the I don't remember properly, but if they say via Kotalo, it's either it's not passing Jimston Lake or it's going to pass Jimston Lake. And people on the train bang bona go to Shemumbana Bam so to gile, I got good to an Aganula Segi. So they, they advised me because I think what is it was Alsberg. You don't wait for a train at it's back, you leave the train station, you go and then you jump because it's dark. It's to eight PM now. But you wear on the other side, and then I think you'll come a pansy, and then you'll drive a good seat. You're at Jimston Lake, and then it talks to Lisa Corn. It's like 12 friends. I come my money. I have 11 grand, but it's 12 friend. Nobody. Love it, I love it. I don't know if you're a deal. I'm 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 of the train so now i get up and then um lisa sits down 
And when I got to when the doors opened and I saw Elizabeth Kutinja, I was like, Anyeg. Mbona masati kazi chani unkaga. Chani unkaga. Ngati tzala wakina kuchuba. Gumnyama. There's no one there waiting for a train. I was like, I'm too scared. I'm so scared. I'm not noticing happy. I'm not about, I, I was so scared. I literally got to the door like this. And then I was like, I can't. I did this, I can't. But love of love. I remember they were saying, Nabo, I can't, Nabo, I can't. Because I need to be, I need to be. And I couldn't, like, I didn't have a game face at the time. I didn't have a poker face. That guy, when he was explaining to me, go to get off this, get off Ellis back, jump, um, take a look. He said it fast, didn't understand. And I was I was just like, yo, it's, he was like, yeah, yes, I'm going to do, I feel I'm going to train, yes, I'm going to do And then when I got there, it was just, I just froze. When I got to the door of the train, I just froze. I went back to Lisa, sat down. Lisa was like, you know, I've done We'll, we'll both get off at Gatlehong and then we'll call your dad from my house because we try to call her call my dad from her phone the blackberry but the blackberry i could be in a dinghy in a valley so it wasn't switching on so she was like you know what i'll tell my i'll ask my granny go to say it did it okay and then you'll call your dad from my crib so i was like okay cool i'm going to Gatlehong now first time went to Gatlehong went to Gatlehong i kid you not that train station was everything the Justin station was not it was lively there was lights there was business people were watching some banana it was just pity pity man there's no way you can get dropped there's no way it's funny things because in Justin Lake you have to wait for the train to pass and then you jump the the sporo there there's like a proper place you can go give it a piece come on man as we walk into lisa's house i think we were like a few streets away oh i'm starting and you know like it's because most people are like very busy yeah but that's like movements not like in the suburbs goods people are in their house they're like oh my gosh this is the ghetto i'm convinced to go to that guy and in bonnie and mini he's behind all of this I was convinced I was like his it's his doing in this fucking jeans that I'm wearing today from then out like my friend. And there's no way I'm gonna battling gag. My friend Lin Cabo Lisa she tells her granny the story. My friend has got a coca booty as phone is using her phone. If I near Coca Lisa, it's at one bar. You know those Dilly Lee's when I don't know how many bars they have like three. My sister phone like me a time. Oh. I'm like, yo, go see him. So now this is just like, ah, it's fine. Then I know my little last of work, so the song is just cool. And because Billy was probably mad the next day. In my head, I was just like, my parents don't play that. Because I'm going to sleep over and contact Clara now. So I'm going to sleep over. No, I'm still going to try and contact my dad. I'm going to be going to eat him go for now. Go for this. So I'm going to sing it at a time, go to one of the puzzle shops, a five randy, say five And then I called my dad. I called my dad twice when I'm on the phone. I'm like, does it give me the phone, Jehovah? Yeah, I called my dad. And then he didn't answer twice. I called my mom because I guess my dad worked in Jameson, but everybody would go home and comes back Monday morning. But sometimes he'd have to like go, maybe have, maybe he'd have a meeting in in Bumalanga, so they go home maybe move on a Wednesday on a Thursday without telling me because we always thought good I'd throw house parties so you just disappear and reappear like a magician so I call my mom just to make sure if my dad is not at the crib because if my dad is at the crib now I'm stuck here I call my mom I'm like I'm like oh okay my mom calls me back she's like I'm going to call my mom so I'm going to call my mom and that's when I answered Lisa's grandmother's phone and I was like, yo, I can leave. She's like, that is cut to go be Zanele. I'm like, Mr. Catlong. She's like, Catlong, what the band Zanet? I'm like, Mac, 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 for five friends, now one bar, you took it, got one thirty. So now I'm losing it. I'm losing it. She's like, that is cut to Zanet, Catlong. Stop so. I'm like, dog. I'm like, I'm trying to get a hold of dad. So I don't know what's happening. So that's why I can't answer my phone. If you need me, call me at this number. But make sure that you call quick because we have one buy and with the gifts line. Shop. 
Then after my dad, mom got a hold of my dad, my dad calls me back on Lisa's grandmother's number. <sighs> my dad calls, he's like, Zanelu whoop. I'm like, Nisa Katlong. Then I go, Pika Katlong, it's a night. I give Lisa the phone. Lisa explains with which garage, close to which garage, I don't know. I still can't tell me. And they go, okay, so don't tell her, I'm garage. I, so they cover me. My dad gets there. Let me tell you what he said, the jokester. Then call. I'm My dad is like, man, you give it on, you wrong, Zanel. I'm like, I'm giving it on, you wrong. I do wrong. So when I'm at you know, he's like, ah, the man is just like, I'm like, I'm not like my train. I'm not like my dear auntie. I'm just like, I'm not like my dear auntie. I'm just like, I'm not like my dear auntie. I'm just like, I'm not like my dear auntie. I'm just like, I'm not like my dear auntie. I'm just like, I'm not like my dear auntie. I'm just so when my mom asks what where did you think Zanella was all this time about 80 when you literally come back home maybe about first five? So I like, I've been calling good to Zanilla so come around like So that's someone who's like, Zanella, hello, Kona, like no. He's like he's not vigilant or he's not focused on me like that he was just like i ukona oh guys so that's how i got lost in the train i stopped using the train because also there was that thing about that train station is not very it's not what it's not safe because me i would go to school go in a short dress a short white dress i want to mom but since i'm not going to go here the lana then i'm going to train station then i'm going to reach your band but i'm not selling out i'm going to pay the lap i'm going to pay the lap and then after that, I just started taking a train wire wire. I started taking taxis to school wire wire. That's really like Chia for real. That's, that's how Johannesburg welcomed me. This is what's left of. Oh, my lord. This is what's left of the fake exit team. Then my Coca Cola. the end of the story time please don't forget to like comment and subscribe and i'll see you on the next one Mwah.